Hello and welcome to another update video about Bitcoin. Only a quick one, not really much to add to the last one. I would encourage you to take a look at the last one for the greater context. A um, bit short on time today, therefore only a quick update. Currently, no evidence that this move down here has finished. The 27.8k level remains a very, very relevant level. Below that level, I will start to favor Bitcoin to drop into this larger box between 25.3 and 22k where it has another chance then to reverse and to find support. Until then, it is still possible to get one more high, but I think it is getting increasingly tricky, increasingly difficult. It will be painful because this structure is not ideal anymore. I did explain that yesterday. And um, I am of the opinion that either we've had a significant top here already and will come back or that we will make one more high and come back then. This is getting increasingly likely at least that the 27.8k level will be tested. And if that breaks, then we have confirmation. I mean, until that breaks, it can of course still rally in the previous structure that we discussed in this direct third wave. But what I explained yesterday already is that this structure is not ideal anymore for a third wave. It just came back to deep. Even now we don't see any buy reactions. I mean, Bitcoin can always surprise, right? But for now we don't see any evidence and um, I'm just increasingly cautious. I explained yesterday that due to the um, dip, even though it's not massive, I mean, we dropped from 30 to 28.8K, right? Um, but that much of a dip is enough for me to say that something isn't quite right. And I wouldn't be surprised if in the next few days, we're going to see the 27.8K level break and we head down. But again, as long as we stay above 27.8, it is very much possible, even likely to get this fifth wave. And then we have the next decision point because it could either be here, this significant top or here. Yeah, um, It is after this high, the pullback that will give us clarity. So if we don't break this 27.8K level now, we have a good chance to make one more high and then the pullback will be the decisive um, moment because that pullback, if it makes a higher low, then we can continue to rally. If it makes a lower low, we take our 27.8K and have a good chance then to see this area. Below 22K, new bear market lows will get much more likely, but it is not until we really take out 19 point, what was that, 19.6, that they get very much in the focus and will become primary expectation again, at least from what I can see now. I can always, you know, depending on what the structure does, we may make changes along the way. Please note that markets are always moving, the context is always changing. And also what I explained about the daily RSI, if eventually we get into this area down here, Bitcoin makes a higher low compared to the 10th of March low, but the RSI is showing oversold, but we have a higher low, then it will be a very bullish sign. Yeah, that's only a quick update. Hope you liked the update. If you did, please hit the like button, leave a comment and subscribe. And if you really like the content, then please check out the channel membership. Thanks a lot for watching. Bye bye.